great game coming up between the Edmonton Oilers and the Dallas Stars. Dallas and Edmonton seemed to be inseparable during a seven-year stretch spanning 97 to 2003. Well, Jim, amazingly, these teams played each other in a whopping six series during that time. Only once did the Oilers manage to defeat the Stars. That came in 1997. Time for the opening face-off for today's game. He coughs up the puck. And that's icing. About to drop the puck. Gathering speed. Shoots quickly. That's blocked by the defender. Chris shot in front. Blocked. It didn't get through. The Oilers have possession and start out of their own zone. Shot the puck from the point. He scores! An early first period goal. That puck was wired in the back of the net. He got all of that slap shot. After allowing the early goal, what do you think's going through their minds, Craig? Well, how do we get that one back? No one likes to let the first one in. There's plenty of time to make good. Fires it! Picked up by Edmonton. They gain the blue line on the attack. Ref indicates a delayed call. Shoots! Another stop. He scores, and we're tied at one. When he gets around the net, it's like a shark to blood in water. He can smell the opportunity to attack. Off goes to the Oilers. A penalty has been called. He's getting called for hooking. You can't do that without paying the consequences. Dallas is about to go to work on its first power play of the game. Let's see if they can cash in. You want to establish a good power play early, even if you don't score. It builds confidence and keeps momentum going. Shoots the puck. Blocked in front of the net. Edmonton scoops it up. Goes behind his net. Delayed penalty coming up. He gets called for holding. Held him up, and the official got him for it. Now his team will have to do without his services. And you can see the coaches having a word with the official about that last call. Both sides are now playing with four players. That'll make some interesting matchups. Playing four on four, look for the defense to jump in the play. Into the corner he goes. Fired the puck just wide of the net. And Dallas takes possession. Quick shot, just wide of the goal. Here come the Oilers, quickly out of their own zone. They're in over the blue line on the attack. Shoots the puck from the slot. Another save. He dumped it in. Shoots it! Here's Duncan Keith. Offside. 
How did he see that one? Yeah, that was a blur, but somehow he got in the way. We're ready for the face-off. Shoots the puck. Hit the man in front of the net. Shot the puck. The Stars have possession and start out of their own zone. Good shot! Under two minutes to go in the first. He stopped that too! Edmonton picks it up. Shots are 7-5 for Dallas. Shoots from the slot! We've got a 1-1 game as the second period gets going. They're getting ready for the face-off. The face-off goes to the Oilers. Quick shot! And he hangs on for a face-off. The ref is signaling for the face-off. The Oilers win another faceoff. Takes a shot. Edmonton takes possession. They move it out at center. Fires it right on. Edmonton gets a hold of it. They'll gather in the puck and start out. Hey, that's a great deep. Who shoots the puck? That's blocked. Delayed call. Getting called for high sticking. That'll get him sent off for two minutes. Dallas will get a second chance on the power play here. Edmonton scooped it up. Cleared out by Keith. Down into the corner. Grabbed by Dallas. Out they come to center. He scores! I think the goalie saw that puck at all. He absolutely teed that one up and ripped it into the net. And he hangs on for a face-off. Dave Tippett led the Stars to a division title and a Western Conference best 111 points in his first season behind the bench. That's right, Jim. And that finish was good for fourth highest point total by a first-year head coach in NHL history. Shoots! 
The ref indicates a delayed call. He gets called for holding. He wrapped his man up and that time the officials saw it. The call's holding and he'll spend two minutes in the box. Dallas has converted once already and they're getting another power play chance here. The faceoff goes to the Stars. Delayed penalty coming up. He's getting called for hooking. Now some people might question that call, but the referee has decided it's worth two minutes in the sin bin. And you can see the coach is having a word with the official because he's not happy about that call. From behind the net. Rips a shot. Corralled by Edmonton. Shoots it. He scores. Late in the second, it's a two goal lead. His stick flexes so much as he loads that shot up. When he lets it fly, it just explodes off his blade. How can this team turn things around? Well, they've got to get their offense firing. Right now, they're losing this race. That's offside. That was one of the best hits you'll see. Perfectly clean, but very effective. The puck is about to be dropped. Less than two minutes to go in the second period. Fires it! Blocked in front of the net. Goaltender's out to play the puck. And he hangs on to the puck. About to drop the puck. The shots are 10-9 for Dallas. Dallas leads 3-1 as we get set for period number three. And Jim, they showed why they're such a dangerous team after scoring two unanswered goals in the second period. We're ready for the faceoff. The faceoff goes to the Oilers. Choose the puck from the point. And he whistled it wide of the net. Shoots the puck. Blocked. Here come the Stars as they move out of their own zone. Fires one right on. That's blocked and didn't get through. 
Who shoots? Hit the man in front of the net. Scooped up by Dallas. Gathering speed. He turned the puck over. Great hands. There's a nice move. Who shoots the puck? Blocked. Here's Duncan Keith. Scoop post! The Stars have possession and start out of their own zone. Offside. This game's looking a little bit like ping pong from here. They just keep dumping it back and forth over the lines. Well, Jim, sooner or later, one of these teams has to start getting some shots. Thunderous hit into the boards. One timer! Grabbed by Edmonton. Shot the puck from the right. Jumped on by Edmonton. He scores! And it's game on. They're back in it, trailing by one. First off, just to be able to get in position to make a play on the puck was a feat itself. Then to be able to deflect it past the goaltender was pure skill. About half a period to go, and it's a one-goal game. As a coach, this is when you look at your bench and ask yourself, who's going to raise their game? Who's going to be the hero? There's a crafty little move. Shot from the left. Edmonton gobbles it up. Shoots quickly. Oh, it's not even close. Over center. Delayed call at center. He gets called for high sticking. A cheap shot on his part, and he's off to the box. Dallas has shown great finish on the power play so far tonight, and they'll get another chance here. One timed it! He scores, and that's a hat trick. When he's coming down on the goalie, he can do so many things, all because of that wicked wrister. by Dallas. Things are heating up, Craig. We're about to get a scrap. These guys aren't wasting any time. short end of this fight. That's the second time he'll be in the box for fighting in this game. A penalty is being called. They're getting ready for the faceoff. The faceoff goes to the Oilers. Right on! He scores to cut the lead to one late in the third. I'd love to see him in a skills competition. I think he has one of the hardest shots in the league. Nice goal. Down by one with less than five minutes remaining. Uh, to come back and tie the game now would be a real accomplishment. He gets stapled. One time shot. That save could very well seal the deal, Jim. He stopped it again. He gains the blue line on the attack. Shoots the puck from the slot. 
out come the Oilers. Here come the Oilers. Running out of time. They need a goal to tie. Down to the final two minutes of the third period. He gave it away. Keith dumps the puck in. Big hit. One-time shot. Oh, he missed. We're down to the final minute of the third. And they get called for icing. That was a tough save. Well, the problem with the backhand is you're not expecting it, so you have to move fast. The ref is signaling for the faceoff. Dallas takes over. They're over the line and on the attack. Right, he scores! Big goal, late in the third, they're up by a pair. The release on that shot is so quick. The goalie barely had time to react to the shot. Nice goal. And with that insurance marker, they pretty much sealed the deal. If they drop two goals in less than a minute, they don't belong in this league. The Oilers have run out of options. Ah, they need goals, and they need the extra attacker. Another shot went just wider than it. One timer. And he just missed the net. Along the boards. Quickly another shot. Oh, and he just missed the net. Taken by Dallas. They bring the puck over the line. He intercepts the puck. Gets away a hard shot. Just missed the net. Behind the net. Into the last 10 seconds of the third. Shoots it. He scores on the empty net. Well, if the fat lady wasn't warming up before this goal, you can bet she's getting ready to sing now. A three-goal lead late in the third. That's pretty much sealed the deal. They've really showed what they're capable of tonight. And that's the end. The Stars won this game. The final score, 6-3. Tonight's third star for Edmonton, number 17, Carlo Aito. From Edmonton, Alberta, that's it for another one. This is Jim Houston with Craig Simpson. See you next time.